הנאות הללו אנו מדליקים, הנאות הללו אנו מדליקים, על הניסים ועל הנפלאות ועל התשועות ועל המלחמות. How do we react at difficult moments? How do we behave at periods which seem darker in our life? On Adam and Eve's first winter on earth, The days turn shorter and shorter. The sages in the Babylon Talmud tell us that when Adam, the first man, saw that the days were progressively getting shorter and shorter, he did not know yet that this is the natural phenomenon of the world. And he, he was afraid and he said, perhaps because I have seen the world is becoming darker and darker and will ultimately return to the state of chaos and disorder. And this is the death that was sentenced upon me from heaven, and it is as it is written, and to dust shall you return. He arose and spent eight days in fasting and in prayer. Once he saw that the days are getting longer, he said clearly, the days first become shorter and then longer, and this is the order of the world. He went and observed the festival of eight days. What was actually the miracle that we celebrate and commemorate on the festival of the lights on Hanukkah? After a long period without a light in a menorah, in a temple, in Jerusalem, after a long dark period, some people still had the faith and believed that the light shall return. They believed that even though human beings are mortal, faith, light, the universe, God Almighty, is eternal. The faith encouraged them to be courageous and to rekindle the menorah, relight the temple, renew the holy worship, and relight their, their souls. My late grandmother, who passed away 51 years ago, during the festival of Hanukkah, always had the faith that someone is guarding us. And even during the darkest days of the Second World War, she believed that the light shall rise and return. She was privileged to enjoy lots of lights and grandchildren in her lifetime. Rabbi Cook is teaching us that each and every one of us, everybody in the world, has a candle burning within us inside us, different candles to different people, but we must all make an effort to relight the candles within us. And together we make a bright, big light and we can rekindle the entire world. Particularly during these times in winter, in challenging periods, as we celebrate Christmas and Hanukkah, We should always remember and have faith that the glory, that God Almighty dwells within us and He will rekindle our souls and the world as the Gospel of John is telling us that was the true light which lightens every man and that cometh into the world. על ידי כהניך הקדושים, בכל שמונת ימי חנוכה, הנרות הללו קודש הם. ואין לנו רשות להשתמש בהם, אלא לראות אותם בלבד. ואין לנו רשות להשתמש בהם, אלא לראות אותם בלבד. כדי להודות ולהללה שמך הגדול על ניסיך ועל נפלאותיך ועל ישועותיך